Ah, see? Maybe that's why we're such great friends, huh? We're old school, we like old-fashioned things. Newspapers, celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know, you tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said, and cut me loose, right? Things are not gonna work out quite that way. There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy, you could say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but- I'm fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career! Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Steve, oh, come whoa! On, please. You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well, then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him, not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American activity. Put your weapons down, all of you. Who the fuck are you with? With me. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. Fuck you! We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your- Who the fuck that? Oh, same goddamn leg! Go! Fuck! Bullshit. Mike, this your frequency. That's over here at the end of the walkway, top of those stairs. I ain't going anywhere, Davy, until some more of these guys kill each other. Hey, hold it well, uh, nine. for the opportunity. Now run! Touching reunion and all, but I'm about to get jumped by a team of rogue agents. T, you got the vantage point. Give Dave a hand. This is the guy who iced Brad and would ice me? I'd be better off putting my sights on him. Haynes made it out of here, and there's another group of agents looking into our shit. Right now, you're not in a position to let our only friend in the bureau get killed. Looks clear. D, make a play for that. And stone bitch by the pool. I'm coming down. Trevor, shoot these guys. More FIB. I need some help. Chopper down! How you doing up there? So tell me, Davey, who are these Bureau men trying to kill me? They're the 4th Division, gone rogue or on the IAA payroll. I thought you were the corrupt division. Corrupt? Only a little. Definitely below average. Get down here when you can. What happens to Haynes? Norton gonna pop him at the water cooler on Monday? I'm not popping Steve, Jesus. I'll get close to him and I'll try to control him. That's if we get out of here alive. Ah, right! You've gotta go across the walkway to the other 
other side of the complex to get... Mercenaries here. I always said I'd check out the court center. as you can, and do not contact me until you're absolutely sure you're clear. This one's mine. Good luck. Stay safe, D. 
Another chopper! Smoking, huh? Come on, man. No, no, no. That's bad for you, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me, huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low-rent hood. Listen, 